good morning children how are you all welcome to english class okay children in previous class we learned the uh, question and answer one question and answer in our lesson 7 right children today we are learning one grammar topic children already completed one we have to revise today okay everyone take your cw book with you and get ready now children what we are having for our examination what are the topics we are having reflexive pronouns we are having and comparison of adjectives okay adjectives of comparison we are having and what prepositions prepositions of time and prepositions of place also we are having right children today we are learning about the adjective children okay adjectives of comparison do you know adjectives children yes we all know adjectives what do you mean by adjectives adjectives are the describing words adjectives are the describing words if it describes about a something or someone okay then we can call that word as a adjective here adjectives of comparison means what children we will describe and we will when we are comparing okay comparison means okar tho okar ni polchi chapra okay okar tho okar ni polchadani in manda comparing okay comparison we will see okay and comparison how we will do we have to describe then only we can compare right children simply we cannot compare we have to compare the qualities in them that means we have to describe about them and we have to compare and this when we are describing and when we are comparing the word can be called as comparison of um, adjectives of comparison adjectives of comparison we can say for example okay and this adjectives of comparison also two forms are there children okay what are those forms we will see now adjective means a describing word tell me one describing word mm, tall tall is a describing word or not children as tall is a describing word that means tall means baga poduga anvarni tall anamata and this tall then two persons i am comparing that means in first bench two boys they have sit this boy is taller than this boy okay first boy is taller than second boy see tall and now this is a adjective right children this one is adjective and telling now what i'm telling first boy is taller than second boy that means how, how this taller changed taller tall changed into taller okay t a l l e r this one changed into taller when i am comparing two members two members when i am comparing two members it changed as tall into taller now and this first boy and second boy are comparing right and again one boy is there he was the he is the tallest boy in the class okay for example his name is rahul rahul is the tallest boy in the class with whom i am comparing with one boy with two boys or with whole the class with whole okay whole the class class andar tho thani polustu cheptunnan and how i am telling rahul is taller boy in the class is correct or rahul is tallest boy in the class which one is correct first one or second one yes second one we should not use taller but we have to use tallest boy in the class that means see children again this tall become as tallest this become as tallest now see tall taller tallest in which cases this become like this tall is a describing word it is a adjective when i am comparing two persons with each other that word became as taller okay that means we have to add er in this and next case when we are comparing three okay or more than three okay ante iddarni polchi cheppinappudu er add chestam adjective when we are comparing with more than two that means three or more than three also okay three kanna ekkuvaina ekku a number of people if you are comparing that person then we have to add est to the adjective okay here we are comparing 
comparing with two, and here we are comparing with three or more than three. Okay, children. Now is it clear? Tall, taller, tallest. Tall base word, and here we have to add er, and next we have to add est. And in some cases, see children here. For example, angry is there. A N G G A N G R by angry is there. Here the word is ending with the Y. Is it a Y letter? Now what we have to do is tell this uh, adjective of comparison. Angry, angrier, angriest. Angry, angrier, angriest. But we should not add here here to that. Like this, we should not write in next one. Uh, in next case, okay, this one will be wrong. What we have to do is this angry will remain same and next a n g r i e r. Okay, that means we have to remove y and add i e. When if the base word ends with y. Base word the last letter y to end out the uh, y minus j c i ne achi now angrier and angriest okay children like this we have to do remaining all will be same uh, you if you got e e in last okay last letter if the last letter in the word is E. Simply we can add R here and ST here. Okay. That means safer, safest. No need to write two E's again. Okay. These are the cases we have to learn children. Okay. Already this one is completed in our class. Right. Now, tall, taller, tallest, angry, minus Y plus I, angrier, angriest. And same. A e will remain same, no need to add another E, just add R only. Here just add ST. Safer, safest. Okay, now let's have some uh, adjectives like this, children. Okay, and you have to write these in your class workbook. After 8th lesson, bring down the hill meanings and hard words also completed, no? After that, next page, keep today's day. And I'll give some list of words, children, you just know them. Otherwise, I'll do one thing, children. In this video, you can't write, no? You can't. By watching the video, I'll send the pic to you. Okay? What you have to do is, you just watch the video and try to understand it clearly. Don't get confused. And I'll send some list of adjectives. You just copy in your class workbook. Practice those. You should get children. Three forms of adjectives you should get. And remember when the word ends with Y, you have to minus the Y and you have to add I. Okay. And remaining also same only. Like you have to add ER and EST. Okay. Changing value changing also you should remember. The spellings also, don't write spelling mistakes. You practice those words and write without seeing in your HW and send them. Okay, children, send me the photo. Thank you. Have a nice day.